well hello 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 everyone to extreme gaming fever and wow it's a very dark scene here we are back in the valley the old farm i have been making some gameplays of this map uh, uh since last week and uh, as i said in one of my previous gameplay that uh, i didn't quit this map playing this map so that's why i'm back once again in this map so Today I've started uh, another carrier in this game with the seasons mode so which means that I'm going to play this map with the seasons mode once again. So you can see that it's very dark here because it's early spring and it's 6.44 am and uh, yeah so today uh, we actually uh, do not have a lot of things to do here because it's in it's the uh, early spring here so first of all i am going to reduce this season's land from nine days to six days uh, now i don't know why uh, but i usually like to go with the six days of season because nine days will uh, will be a really long day and you can also go with the 12 days but i'm going with the uh, six days of a season and uh, all the uh, other settings will be same as it these are by default so that that's all that's all i wanted to share uh, with you so i'm going with the six days of a season all right so you can see that it's pretty much dark here so as i said uh, uh we really do not have a lot of things to do here so today uh but uh still we can uh, start uh, different things so uh, first of all i would like to speed up the clock a little bit and you can see that i've already done this i think i should turn on the lights all right so you can see uh by the way i think it's a uh, day time outside and uh, now the sun is finally rising and uh, i'm going by the way i'm going with the machinery and the tools that i have whenever i you start a new carrier so i'm going uh the by default machinery and the tool that we have so that will really make this series uh, even more exciting uh sorry for that noise <laughs> all right so uh you can see that uh we have this uh, new holland tractor so if I talk about the fields that we have, then we have uh, multiple fields here, field number 91, 92, 93, field number 2, 25, and 26. And uh, um <coughs> field number 91, 92, and 93 needs to be created, otherwise you will not be able to work on these fields. So uh, um, currently these are not in use, so if you don't want to use these fields, you uh, have to uh, plow these fields you can do the same thing by cultivating the fields or uh, by drag uh, doing some drilling with the amazon condor if you like because uh, the amazon condor has the ability to directly plant something on a field which is even not cultivated sorry for that bad glitch and today i am actually uh, interested to uh, plow some start some uh, some plowing so you can see that it's a very uh cloudy weather today uh today we cannot plant anything here uh we can actually plant some crops here but uh i would like to plant the crops uh with uh, when it's their optimum temperature so today it's uh one degree celsius which means that we cannot plant some crops as i said we can plant but i would like to uh plant these crops uh <coughs> when it's uh, their optimum temperature so you can see that we have the very basic machinery we have this case IH tractor but I can't see the plow where is the plow so uh, it's not here we have this uh, tipper here small tipper but where is the plow all oh, right so it's there so now I need to get in the case IH tractor because this tractor has more horsepower uh, probably 146 horsepower so you can see that uh, it's a 1455 XL and now I'm going to uh, plowing uh, the field number uh, 91 probably uh, with this tractor and uh, that will really take a lot of time because I'm sure that the plow that we have uh, probably has the maximum working range of 2 to 3 meters so the field is 
quite large and it will definitely take a lot of time so don't worry i will speed up the video and in this way this uh, video will also be like a little bit time lapse video so you can see that we have uh, this bow here and now let's move to the field oh sorry for that um that was very bad driving there so I actually play on keyboard, I do not have any steering wheel. I'm planning to buy a, a C-Track or the Logitech steering wheel. But for this moment it's out of my budget so I have to go with the keyboard. So uh, by the way <laughs> that, that, ro uh, that mud road is not, uh, that road is very strange. It's it sometimes bumps a lot so this is the field on which we are going to work now I can cultivate this field and uh, create a new field simply by cultivating this but I think I should plow this field because plowing a field uh, really increase the yield of your crop so that's why I'm going to plow and yeah so Pressing Y will allow this plot to create new fields. Alright, so first of all, uh, you can see that it's now. So first of all, uh, I'm going to create an outline for my field. And after that, uh, I will create the field, the rest of the field inside that outline. So first of all, I'm going to create an outline. So as I said, uh, you can simply create your field, uh, any field, uh, by simply using the cultivator. But the reason why I'm going with the flow uh, is that uh, in this way, uh, by default, if you start a new carrier, all the fields require flowing, uh, which means uh, even uh, uh, yeah. So these are the con soil composition when you start a new carrier. Everyone knows. So all the fields require plowing, so that's why I'm going with the plowing. And uh, yeah, so let's create an outline. So you can see that this tractor has a very, uh, this plow has a very small working range. But don't worry, this will be super fun because I really like uh, to do so. So let's see the soil composition, and you can see that. Uh, almost all the fields needs plowing yes all the fields needs plowing and that's why I'm going with plowing so today we will create uh, that field is already created by the way uh, this is the field number 91 but all I'm going to do is to plow this field because that's all we can do today because uh, the temperature is not suitable for planting crops so if I want a realistic uh, farming in this game so I have to do everything uh, which we usually do in real life so I have to wait for the optimum temperature to plant new crops and I'm actually not uh, cultivating uh, near the edges because uh, it, it becomes a very challenge to <laughs> plant something near the fences because uh, uh, that seeder or the planter you will use uh, can interact with these uh, can uh, uh, whatever you <laughs> say to avoid uh, collision so finally uh, the outline is I just made an outline for my field so this is how my field will look like so now I, is, I what I will do is to simply plow inside this outline and now I think it will be really really easy alright so I'm going to fast forward this video because this will really take a lot of time to plow this field completely so let's speed this video a little bit I 
I wish if we get a 3D field in Bombing Simulator 19. Alright, so let's speed it speed this up. Alright guys, so um, I have almost done here and uh, it really took a lot of time. You can see it's uh, <laughs> it's 3.40 p.m. and uh, yeah, I spent the almost whole day uh, plowing this field and uh, yeah, so I still have left some patches here uh, but don't worry, uh, it really... Uh, it doesn't make any difference uh, by the way overall i have loaded this whole field and now uh, i'm just simply uh, recovering some really big patches which i have left uh, because i usually uh, do not plow fields so i have no experience plowing the fields and working with plows just a little bit there and yeah i think that was a nice job and if i see here uh it will still it's still so, uh, showing some patches here uh, which are which are probably here but i'm not uh, going to cover these because uh, it, i don't think that uh, these will make any difference all right so let's move back to the farm and uh, in this way this first day uh, the of the spring uh, ended and uh, let's see what we can do uh, in the next day and uh, yeah so running on this road i have to be extra careful because this road is very very bumpy So that, that, that was a nice experience for me and I really enjoyed myself. I'm tired a little bit <laughs> uh, but yeah that overall that was amazing. So I'm not going to park that low there uh, on where it was uh, parked before but I'm going to simply park this one here.
and no I think I should park my tractor here so I think I should park this here if I can so this flow has a very strange wheel physics oh my god just look at that come on please alright so now I think it's perfect here and yeah so uh, finally I just parked that plow here and now let's uh, park this tractor here oh I forgot to turn off the engine and yeah so this is that that was the first day in, in the valley the old farm with seasons mode and that was early spring so in the next gameplay we will definitely plant some crops so I'm sure that you will definitely enjoy this gameplay uh, we will also try to create some new fields if we can and you can see the field number 92 is even more <laughs> even uh, bigger than the field number 91 so that will really take a lot of time and yeah so we also have the field number 26 which needs to be created actually that field is already created but we need to um, plow or cultivate that field all right so i'm sure that you will really enjoy this gameplay so we really have a lot of things to do in the next gameplay so i'm sure that i will see you in the next one very soon bye and thanks for watching mm -hmm.